Hello guys, Solitary Gamer here, back to another part of Fire Emblem Awakening, and let's get started. Okay, so in my free time, I was able to Master Seal Cordelia into a Dark Flyer. Okay, so, so let's get to the story. In the chapter, yes. Hurry, there should be enough carriages waiting just for the raven, Robin, Ravine. Oh, he's upset. Please. Berg. I'm, I'm coming. Quickly, we're almost, hot damn. Plagians, I knew it couldn't be that easy. They're right in our way, we must fight. Okay, let's fight. Who should I take out? Okay, let's see. Who should I take out? I like this team. Okay, let's fight. Wait, let me look at support first. Nope. Okay. Hold there. Ulysses, I offer you mercy. Surrender to me now and live. Hold on. Surrender. Sorry, I'm not familiar with that with the word. Hmm. Emren will not have wish for this to come to bloodshed. Bloodshed. Damn you. Do, don't speak her name. Hmm. Your rage justified, Prince Krom. But the meaning of your sister's sacrifice of your sister's final sacrifice was not lost on me. I suspect many plagueants who heard her final words would say the same. If you lay down your weapons, I vow to protect you as best I can. What? How can we trust you after what your barbarous king has done? I think we shall take our chances with, with weapons in hand. Mm -hmm. I suspect you would say as much. So be it, Prince Krom. I shall endeavor to grant you a swift and dignified end. Okay. Let's attack. Okay, that one's... Okay, that one's gone. Let's attack here. With Elk Thunder. Okay, so let's check this. Okay, he's the limit. Okay, now let's move Frederick and attack this one. Move her here. Move Krom here. Let's move Libra here. Let's move Sumia here. Let's move Muriel here. Move Anna over here. Oh, should probably just cover this thing. I have to cover this thing just in case. All right, so let's. What are those thieves I see scattered about? So they found a battlefield. 
They call me for trinkets and spoils. Then scurry away like mice. Blipa. We shall bring them justice later. First, the Ulyssians. Okay, where is... Okay, let's attack here. Let's attack this one. Okay, let's attack this one. Okay, let's have Krom attack this one. Okay, let's have our attack here. Let's move here and wait. Okay, let's have her attack here. Okay, so let's have Frederick. No, let's have her. Oh, she can't do much damage. Wait. Okay, let's attack here. Your last breath approaches. Nice. Okay, that one's gone. Let's have her wait. Forgive me, sir, but I no longer see the justice in hunting down these people. These hunting these people down. I accept any punishment you see fit, but after all that's happened, I just can't. How dare you question General's orders? You know full well the punishment for insubordination is death. But, sir, these people are. These questions are not ours to ponder, lad. The soldier does not judge. The soldier deserve, delivers judgment. Sir, I, I cannot raise my lance against them, even if it even if it means death. You were there when Embryon spoke, weren't you? So be it. Those of you unwilling to fight are dismissed. But I, but I don't wish to abandon you, sir. I cannot defy the king, lad. I know him well. He would murder my wife and child to set an example. I will accept the blame for your actions today. Now go. Wait, General! Just go already! I see a cause worth fighting for. One I believe in. Loyalty to my general. All right, that's good, lad.
Oh, nice. Nope, can't hit her. You can't hit her. She's too fast. Okay. Now, only a couple left. Missed again. Oh no. Okay. Another one. Okay, let's have our attack here. Attack this one. Okay, let's have Cordelia attack this one. Whoa, did I just step on, some on something? I hope it didn't break it. Okay, yes, convoy. Let's move her here and wait. Okay, let's wait here. And wait here. Cast attack. That one's gone. Now let's have Frederick attack this one. I took upon myself to clear away a bit of gravel here. Safety first. Only a couple left. Wait. Okay, let's wait. Call your reinforcements. Oh no. Let's have our attack. That's the boss? I am General, General Mustafa of Plagia. If you wish to keep your lives, then you must win them. Okay, I will. Oh, 
that was easy. Well done, Ulysses, sir. Please spare my men. Con Basilio. Yes? Olivia, I'm sorry. We kept you waiting. <sighs> well, I didn't hear from you. I thought I assumed the worst. Hey. Chrome, Shiro, meet Olivia. She'll be sm smuggling us out of here. <sighs> Only if you hurry. Doubtless, more of the madman's, a mad king, men are on, the, on, our, are on their way. All right. Right, power on, you lot. And bid farewell to this plague in hellhole. All right. Ready? Hold on tight. Hit save. <laughs> All of that for nothing. Sob, sniff, OM. I should have died before allowing the exalt to be captured. I, I have failed as a knight. So what now, Oaf? Don't look to me, I'm not in charge. Oh, I gotta pick a fine time to regain the full throne. Chrome, I'm, so I'm so sorry, my plan just wasn't enough. You did your best, Shiro, you have my thanks. It's my own failures that haunt me now. I was just so powerless. It's not your fault either, Chrome. She did it for me, Shiro. So that I wouldn't have to live with the guilt of either choice. She chose for me. She sacrificed herself rather than give up what could one day save her people. Chrome, hey. listen to me. Look at me. All right. I was powerless once too, remember? And yes, alone. I don't think either one of us is half the person your sister was. But together, maybe we can be, now maybe we can be something more. If you fall, I'll be there to pull you back up. When you fight for your sister's ideals, I'll be by your side. You don't have to become your sister. You know, you can still be true to yourself. You just have to give hope. You just, you just have to give people hope in whatever way you can. Still... And what if I can't? What if I'm not worthy of her ideals? Shiro, what if I drag you down with me? Yeah. If you're not worthy, I'll keep, you'll keep at it until you are. And if we both fall down, well, that's what friends are for, isn't it? Hang in there. That's right, I wouldn't even be here if not, if not for you. Just don't fail. You gave me your trust, and now you have mine. For the time being. Don't falter. Were you unworthy? I would have left long ago. What a pill. It took great courage and charisma to unite all of us. I know I possess such talents, but clearly you do as well. Right. Right, we all look up to you. You're like a hero to us. Thank you everyone, your words mean more than you could know. <sighs> my shepherds, my warriors, there's work to be done. Gone rail must be stopped so that peace can once again reign in Ulysses. Will you help me? You can, you can count me in. I'm tired of crying all the time. It's time to punch. It's time to start punching stuff. You can do it. Here, here, darling. Our people have suffered enough. Need a hand? Gladly will I fight and die for House Yulee. Say. Got you covered. Gladly I would will I fight and kill those dastards for House Yulee. Say. May the gods bless us. Our hearts echo yours, sire. Stand tall. I will be. I will be the. Unbreakable shield by your side. Don't forget me. I'm with you too. You know, just in case anyone. Hello. Thank me later. Teach is here and class is in ses session. Is How much you paid, Gregor? Yeah, Gregor make joke. Why look at Gregor like that? Allow me. Your sister earned my respect. Last toggle shall champion her. You have grown strong, my lord. I may have said bags of a poor example as a knight, but I swear to you I shall die before any more exhaust blood is spilled. Thank you. Thank you all, truly. You honor me with your fealty. fealty. Again. We shall answer this outrage. The Mad King must be stopped. <laughs> right, it's time for old Gangrel to get a dose of his own Volane Rari Rari. The whole of the Feroxy army is yours to send crashing against him. Hard, you young folk. Your passions run so hot. If I had any gray hairs, you would sing them right off. 
In other words, keep me count me in. I'd like to go too, if I may. The Exalt did me a kindness once. Really? She did? Yes. yes, sire, it would honor me to have a part in giving her justice. Although, all I can do is dance. And I'm not so skilled at that, if, I, if we're being honest. Uh, she's too modest. Olivia is a Feroxy treasure. You won't meet a finer dancer in all the realms. Her moves inspire soldiers to work twice as hard. You do well to bring her along, Commander. What? Commander, what happened to boy? Right. You're on your way up from that name, I think. Now, where were you? Oh, yes, I was just about to start cracking skulls. Flavia, Flavia will lead me and the other Feroxy in head-on assault. That should buy enough time to take down Gonril. Hear that, boy? You get the fun parts. Still... I thought you were going to call me. Right. You and Shiro have my every confidence. You're a born leader, and he has a knack for guiding troops to victory. You both have some growing to do yet, but I can already see you, you'll you grow tall. <laughs> Thanks, Bazio. <laughs> Alright, enough talk. It's time to raise him hell. Yes. Right! Let's get to it then. Garil may try to hit us while we're still licking our wounds. Right. Let him try. This time I'm ready to dethrone the Mad King once and for all. Okay, what's here? Nothing? Anything here? Anything here? Okay, let's fight. Okay, I only need I only need Mary Bell and Cordelia. Okay, let's fight. Okay, let's have her join Cordelia. What? Oh no. Okay, let's actually separate them. No! Oh. Okay. Okay, one down. Okay, let's attack this one. Okay, let's attack this one. Okay, let's use her to attack. More? Oh, great. Yeah. 
What? Why are they targeting him? Let's let's heal. Okay, let's attack. Okay, let's attack this one. Okay, that wasn't too tough. Okay. My lord. Oh, brave axe, okay. Okay, now can use a master seal, I think. On Who should I use Master Seal on? Okay, I'm not. I can't use it on her. See, I can't use it on her. Can't use it on her. Can't. No, it would not be good to use it on him. Not Frederick. Not Anna. What about her? Nope, can't use it on her. Use on him? Nope. So it's between Mario and Marielle and Kellum. Who should I use it on? Okay, let's use it on Kellum. Let's have him become a great knight. Okay. Let's give, let's give him a... What should I give him? Let's give him this. The 
Let's give him a sword. And an axe. And let's sell... Let's sell all these. Let's sell this. Okay, let's give Mary Bell. Okay, no, let's see. Let's give Shiro. Where's Shiro? Yeah, it needs more speed. Alright. Let's give Pane a. a she has Brave Axe, Brave Axe. Okay, let's take this for her. Alright, let's go to chapter 11. The enemy has taken the field, me lord. Back already? Ha, it feels as though we just said our goodbyes. Our scouts report they are in surprisingly good spirits. Since when do you trust our scouts? Besides, what does it matter? They are armed like beggars compared to us. I could break their ranks as easily as, easily as, as I break wind. I love to hear a song the bards make of that. Aversa, there's a truth about the world. This Ulysses whelp must learn. A man is either strong or he's dead. Ah. Your Highness, dire news. Oh, speak. Our troops are laying down their weapons and deserting in mass. Please, sire, I am but a messenger. Have mercy. Nope, he's dead. He's gonna kill him. I have a report from Con Flavia. The Plagian army is in disarray. What? What? How do you mean? Right. Seems many of the soldiers are opposed to further violence. There has been infighting, desert desertation, desertion. Conro is trying to stamp out the mutiny. This mutiny, the mutiny by force, but with little success. Outside of a few faithful who serve him directly, his army has all but collapsed. Wow. This is incredible news. But why? Embryon, oh. Ah. Yes, my lord, Embryon, Embryon. The report says Gonro men chant her name as they abandon the field. Her words and her sacrifice have made her a folk hero of sorts. Embryon, so her sacrifice didn't go in vain. Why it take me so long to understand? She believed all people deserve peace. She knew deep down the Plagans wanted to. It just took her to bring it to the service. Right. I hope she can see this. Wherever she is. Today we bring an end to Mad King's Gonro and bring peace back to the land. Okay, let's see. Taking her out, bring him Kelman. Okay, let's Okay, who should I should I put anyone else in? I 
All right, let's go. Let's save just in case. All right, let's fight. Good day, my little princeling. Still dreaming of your squash sister? No more talk, Anro. Today you die, and peace returns to Yusei and Plagia. Ha, huh. ah, such hypocrisy. You spies, the wretch. You won't cut me down. You don't know the first thing about peace. No man does. I know more than you ever will. More than me, more than me? Bah, you are me. When life asks you a question, you answer it with blood. Maybe you're right. I'll never be my sister, but I cannot forgive the men like you. Men who sold nothing but evil. All I have left are her words and her memory. Were I alone, I might be driven to madness or worse. But I'm not alone, my friends and my brother in arms stand behind me. Are you done, man? Vomit now? Uh, what a flowery. Honoring you? I haven't heard that word before. Men are beasts, nothing more. We fight, we kill, we, de we devour our prey. Beasts do not stand behind beasts, little prince. They use each other only so long as it suits their own selfish purpose. Perhaps this explains why our own soldiers refuse to stand behind you. You are a, po you are a poison, a festering wound, and, I'll do my and I will do what my sister could not. Such a clever tongue you have, little prince. It will look quite fetching, hanging on my mantle next to your sister's corpse. Me lord, I have come. Am I too late? I don't claim my dance as anything special, but King Bazio says it renews the spirit. Okay, she can dance. Okay, guys. Move here. Let's move here. Move here. Move here. Another one down, all right. Nope. Okay, who else? Nope. You can't hit her. She's way too strong. All right. <clears throat> yes, draw closer. Let them charge at me with their rage. More of my soldiers shall greet them at every full step. attack here okay let's attack here
Okay, so wait here. Move down here. Move her here. Okay, so wait here. And move her here. Move her here and wait. Whoa! He actually did damage. That one's gone. Nope. She's too OP. Oh, great. Attack this one. Okay, let's attack this mage. Okay, attack this one. have Libra attack this soldier Attack here. Let's attack on rail. Clinging to each other won't save you, maggots, when the boot falls. Nope, miss. Oh, oh, look at it. spin. Fool of a prince, your people care not for you. You are alone. As every man lives and dies alone. Nope, just you. All right, you got a Levian sword. Okay, deal with magical damage based on magic.
Okay. Move here. You can learn a lot about this world from a Pegasus back. I see new things every day. Move down here. Alright, we're done. Nope, miss. Is have her move up here and attack this one. Let's attack, let's attack this one. Okay, only two left. Can she kill? Yes, she can. Okay, let's kill this soldier. This mage. Okay, just one left. Okay, that wasn't too tough. Sire. The remaining Plagian forces are surrounding in mass. Good. Order, order our forces to cease fighting at once. Sire. Yes, sire. <sighs> then it's finished. Once the messenger delivers our terms, that's it. We put an end to this bloody business once and for all. We've won. Somehow, I don't feel like celebrating. Victory can be bitter as well as sweet, boy. It's good you learned that now. Regna Varox lost many good soldiers today. We need to see to her dead. Then it's time to attend to the living and rebuild our army. I'm sorry, Flavia. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. You least say we'll compensate your nation in whatever fashion. Oh, in that case, how about you hand over the fire emblem, and we call it even. No, we can't do that. Ah, uh, just a little Feroxy humor. Don't worry about- don't worry after our finances, Chrome. Reparations will fall to Plagia, and I've, and I've seen their treasury. They can well afford it. Yes, pay the man who stands between Fla Flavia and a full coffer, boy. Yeah, I have to remember that. When you come to visit, you'll, you'll as tall. Oh, Captain, you hurt? I was concerned. No, I'm fine, Sully. I just... Wait, you're concerned? Um... Yes, your arse head. Concerned. I have a mouth of filth, not hard stone. Ah, <laughs> uh, same old Sully. 
No, sometimes I forget. You all, you've always been there for me. You've been flying on my side for years, you know. Yeah. Of course I know I was there, remember? Right. Hold on, Sully, I'm being serious. Just listen just listen for a moment. You've been coming to my rescue for as long as the shepherds have existed. And I need a lot of rescuing. Right. You don't don't you know that's because I Oh, she loves him? Oh him I mean it's my duty, sir. But you sell yourself short, Captain. Most men will collapse rather than suffer a fraction of what you've been through. But you shoulder it alone and without complaints. You're a damn good man. You're amazing. Oh, wow. Sully, what you said just now. Mm -hmm. The arse head part? No, sorry, no, after that. About how I go, at, go it alone. I don't want to anymore, Sully. I want to have a partner to share it with the good and bad. All of it. Oh, is he going to propose her? My sister always followed her heart. So now, I'm going to follow mine. Sully, will you marry me? Where did this come from? They... They didn't even date before. They're, they, they're getting married before they even date? Yeah. Ha ha ha, that's rich, Captain. Damn, you sure know how to. Um, how to? Oh crap, you're being you're serious, aren't you? Perhaps this might answer your question. Yeah. As a ring, but this bears a Ulysses and Cress. You shouldn't. Hmm. My parents had it, made, had it made to celebrate my birth. They wanted me to give it to the woman I would spend my life with. Take it, take it, and know I will fight with you and for you until my last breath. This is all oh, chrome. I can't freaking believe this. Thank you. I need to ask for a bit of patience for the near future. My first duty will be to heal the scars of war and assume my role for the people. But then we can begin our life together. <laughs> oh, I'm not going anywhere. It's fine. I know you so. For, I know you for so long. Practically one mind. But I didn't see this coming at all. I didn't see it. I didn't see it either. I feel happy. Happy beyond belief. Like where did this come from? What have you done to me, you you damn son of a griffin? I know together we can bring joy back to Royal Palace. I'll do everything I can to make the castle a happy home for us, my love. Nah. Okay, it's going to take some getting used to. Oh, is this... They're getting married? Oh, no. And so the war between Ulysse and Plagia was ended. Prince Chrome and Shiro worked tirelessly to restore Ulysse's splendor. This would be no easy task, for the war had taken a heavy toll on the Halidome. But with Froxy's muscle and Plagian's gold, they brought peace back to the people. All the while, the prince forswore the title of Exalts out of respect to his late sister. Even so, his subjects grew eager for their new ruler to take a wife. And in his heart, Chrome had always known who that woman would be. The royal wedding was a joyous occasion, attended by thousands from near and far. Finally, seeing that the lo the last lingering wounds of Elise's history has healed, had healed, but then two years later, what happened? What 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 happened? Did he just did he go mad with power or? What happened, what happened to the piece? Let's see, a messenger from Regna Farox. Good. See them in at once. Yes, my lord. Your grace. Prince Chrome, I come on behalf of Khan's Regnat Regnet Fla Flavia. <laughs> Flavia, well, this surprise is something amiss. Right away. I fear so, my me lord. The Khan requests your presence as summons as soon as you're able. Really? What happened? Yes, my lord. Our western neighbors of Baum are no longer acting so neighborly. The Emperor, who they named the Conqueror, has launched warships against us. What? An invasion, are you certain of this? Forgive me. Yes, my lord, the Khan hopes to meet you, meet with you in Fae Rocks, if it pleases you. Please you. Hello. What do you make of this, sire? Right. Uh, it's a little business for to be sure. Is that an error? A typo? Rami will meet with Flavia at once. I know we're gonna say, Sully, but your old Regna Ferox a great death. I must appraise myself of the facts there before deciding on a course of action. Right. Ha, huh, and I suppose I'll stay here, right? Fluff the pillows, bake some damn pies. Maybe knit a, bill a blanket so you can snuggle it up in your own damn pig headedness. Hell of that, I'm coming. 
Oh, that child! But Lucena is newly born. She needs her mother now. She needs milk, Grom, not mothers. She can be a wet nurse like the rest of House Elise. Hell, you and Lisa turned out fine, didn't you? Lucina is a strong child. She takes after her father. The brand in her left eye proves it. And I'll let you be the only and I'll not let you be the only one to set a strong example. Still... Sully, please, will you just you can, you can try to stop me. You can try to stop me, Chrome. Maybe even sneak away on your own. But you of all people know how I ride when I'm motivated. I'll catch you. <laughs> Barry, just give in right now, Chrome. I mean, it's not like you'll ever win an argument with Sully in any way. Lisa, you're not helping. Just promise me if there's any danger, you'll stay out of it. Sully, please. Lisa and I had M, of course, but we lost our parents when we were young. I want Lucina to grow up with her whole family around her. Yeah. Yes, her whole family. Just remember that means both of us. My lord. I will ride ahead and symbol and escort me, Lord. Mm. Thank you, Frederick. Whoa. I'm quite impressed, Grom. You make a fine ruler. You've come a long way from telling sheep. <laughs> ah, have I truly changed so much? <laughs> mm, in a way, you haven't. But you've grown as a leader, and of course as a father. Right. I've tried to, to do my best. My sister left a weighty legacy. I do all I can to just live up to it. I apologize, I could not come sooner, Flavia. Hey. What matters is you're here now. You is, is you're here, Chrome. You all right? Is it true, Vami says, warships have set sail? What can you tell us? <sighs> not much more than that, I'm afraid. The details remain hazy. Just moments. Oh, where are you, you big, bald? Oh, Chrome is here. Ah, oh, well met, boy. I knew you'd come. We have someone you should hear from. I believe you met. He claims to have insight into Vom's intentions. Greetings. Good day, lords and ladies. How fair you are. Allow me the great pleasure and indeed honor of introducing myself. What? We all know who you are, Virion. Although I don't know, I don't, I don't believe we met your companion. Oh. Hmm, you know nothing. Pre pre prepare for my great unmasking. Long have I posed as Arches of Archers, yet that was but a ruse. Yes, and artifice to disguise myself as a mere above average man. In truth, I am. Ahem, may I present Duke Varun. I'm his humble servant, Sure Che. Greetings, sire. Greetings with your presence. Sure, Che. You stole my moments. Listen. A pleasure, Sure, Che. Perhaps you could speak on your master's behalf. Well, that may speed things along, yes? Good. Then please, time is of the essence. Huh. Very well, then. First, concerning our orig origins, we hail from Rosanna, a fertile territory on the continent of Vom. My lord is the head of House Braun and the rightful ruler of Rosanna. In uh, fact, he often reminds himself, and loudly. My, my. Ha, is she not a true wit? She gets it all from me, you know. Hmm? So it brings Noble and his charge all the way across the long sea. Oh, yes. The Vamis say, Theirs was an unremarkable nation once. Tiny, but almost pitifully so. Had a continent not shared its name. You might, or you might almost have forgotten it existed. And so Vom may, might have remained if not for Walhart the Conqueror. One by one he has taken the surrounding realms into his growing empire. I had no choice but to run, oh run, oh run, that is to recruit new allies to aid my people. That's why I've come. You fled for your life, yup. Oh More or less, yes. While my lord has ga hastily gathered his valuables and guided his people out of safety, I alone remain to keep an eye on the Vamise crisis. I was there as Roseanne was swallowed up by Emperor Walhart's overwhelming forces. In the end, I too fled here to Regna 
Murlocs seeking exile. Mm -hmm. To my great relief, I might add, eligible women are one of Roseanne's most precious natural resources. It will be a shame to waste any, even one who cuts off her lord and mass. Ahem. As I was saying, yes, yes, all right, it was only a shape. Please, by all means, you may continue. So begging your pardons, but perhaps it's time to, get, to cut this long story short. Walhart has conquered our continent and now seeks to conquer yours. Okay, we gotta stop Walhart then. Right. She claims the Valmise fleet will, will be at our shores in a matter of days. We'll know soon enough if her story proves true. Oh. I speak only what I know for, tr for true, good people. As does my lord, at least with respect to this matter. There is that wit of yours again, aha. Huh? That wonderful healing, chaffing, wits. I believe you both. Basilio, you must secure your hordes as soon as possible. You should know that Vom has the strongest cavalry in the world. You, you will want to station troops with experience fighting mounted troops. Why, Bron, are you volunteering? volunteering? Let's see what's here. Okay, that's that's next objective. What's up here? Okay, let's go down here. Anything here? Okay, I'm going to stop here for today. Thank you for watching this video. Have a great night, wherever you are. And please like and subscribe if you enjoy the video. And please comment if you found anything interesting in the video.